it's game day. Southampton take on Everton here at St Mary's Stadium and it's a must win game for Southampton today. Not sure what we're going to do if we don't win, whether it's the end of Russell Martin or whether we decide to keep him. Just walking around the back of the away stand and uh, yeah, the coaches are all arriving for Everton fans. So they're going to be hoping for a, a win for them and both teams need it, but they are on the up whereas we are not anywhere at all. We must win today, and if we don't, I personally I feel like that's our season over. It's a tough one. Just having a quick walk through Kingsland, and uh, Arsenal are losing. Duck, 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 duck. We've just made a quick pit stop at uh, Kingsland stand and uh, got a table, uh, first time in a long time, and got a beer from the stand. Spot on. And we've also got ourselves uh, some Quackers loaded chicken fries. Here we go. Apologies, my girlfriend started digging in before I even had a chance to show you. Uh, look at that face. <laughs> Yeah, all right, lovely. So it's uh, 2.20, and this is the crowd outside the King Kingsland. Uh, don't usually come through this bit, but everybody's watching the TV. Massive crowd. The queue for the Gasworks bar, pretty big. And the Quackers queue comes out here and runs all the way back this way. It's the Northern Fan Zone again heaving and the live music is big town boppers today big screen still showing that Newcastle have beaten Arsenal 1-0 good result for them they needed that I just can't get over how heaving it is out here just insanely busy like there's just a procession through <laughs> but it's mental uh, i think they need to make this uh, section a lot bigger now score prediction two nil saints two nil saints hopefully yeah yeah how don't know but uh, after tuesday's performance they show they can win, so yeah. hopefully put in practice today. What's the score today, mate? 3 1 Saints. 3 1 Saints. Adam Armstrong Brace. Adam Armstrong. Score prediction today? 2 1 Saints. 2 1 Saints. What do you reckon? 1 1. We're 10 minutes in and. Um, we are playing sloppy, we've just given the ball away just outside our box twice. They really need to get a hold of this. They're, they're making the wrong decision at the wrong time. Uh, and that's exactly where teams know where they can hurt us. They've just got to get a hold of this and play the right passes forward. Uh, Steven's trying to play a ball to no one a minute ago uh, and then blaming Manning. So yeah, they need to get a hold of this. Oh, straight across our our box there. We didn't we didn't pick up on that. We didn't get it. It's a bit ropey so far for us. That's a new one. Uh, somebody's shouting, "Mark him up!" Getting into him. Uh, so yeah, the fans deciding that. The Saints players aren't getting into the players hard enough or quick enough. And uh, yeah, I, I agree actually. We're just letting everything boss it so far. Right, 21 minutes. And um, that's literally what you're in for. The fans, again, not happy with the referee and the assistant ref in. And it's a messy game so far. Everton's game is to break up our play. Not that we have that much of it right now, but corner to them. Wow, really bad challenge there from what it looked like. 
just took out the man completely from the defence. 23 minutes, 25 seconds. Looks like he already gave a yellow card. That was a really bad challenge from what I can see. She's bored already. Stoppages in this game are crazy. We're 33 minutes in and they're just taking the nick out of it. Clearly they're disrupting. Yeah, again, we're giving it away. 36 minutes, giving it away, and they've had another clear break at goal. Good punch, Ramsdale. Really good. Giving it away again. Luckily, Everton are as shite as we are right now. We are getting off lucky. No offence to you, Everton fans. I spoke to you a few before. You said the same thing. So half time and uh, they've taken off Lalana and brought on Aribo. Oh, oh, oh. So we had a couple more chances in the, towards our second half, end of the second half. And the thing is, I'm just really not sure where the goal is coming from. It, it's just concerning. Like we we make our way up to the halfway line, we've got no end product. And as much as I love good looking football, like sometimes we try and play, we, we're just not getting the result that we need. More crowd violence. St. Mary's, the hot spot. We don't watch the football, we watch the crowd. <laughs> Boxing match here. Yeah? Go on! <laughs> He's had enough. Distraction there, little distraction. Anyway, back to the back to the action. Right, uh, I'm not sure which way to look now. I must apologise. I, I didn't know where to look. Uh, the action was off the pitch, and then it was on the pitch, mostly off the pitch. The action is back on the pitch, 53 minutes in. No more well, we're now behind us for this free kick. No Even the missus is singing. We're ready for a goal now, come on. Premier League, Northern Stand, let's have it. In swing alone. Oh, it's gone wide. Let's go! Let's go! Terrible corner, Manning. He got the cat crazy and didn't deliver the milk. Oh. <laughs> what a dive from Bickford there. That was a bit dramatic. Everton fans showing their support down that end. They've just got themselves a corner. 58 minutes. We're under a bit. Sixtieth minute substitution. Straight at it, dribbling there. Adam Armstrong on the left hand side. Ball in to back post for Rebo. Nothing. Yes, I'm surprised. Very surprised to see Manny coming off. 
So it looks like Jack Stevens is out onto the left wing, uh, sorry, left back. So back four now. We really want to keep him in the team that bad, eh? Okay, Russell. So the change taken off the defender is perfect. Oh, Adam Armstrong, whoa! Dude! Come on, Adam! Going from a back five to a back four has made a difference. It's a good thing. A uh, moment of possession there for Everton and uh, looked like it went in. It didn't, their crowd cheered. We didn't, we cheered when it wasn't in. We're on the 76th minute and they've just announced that they're checking for a possible red card and it's been overturned. Absolute joke. Oh, come on, you must know this. Jerks. Jack Stevens is coming off. A few people have been asking for that. And Sigawara coming on. Uh, why we didn't just do that to start with, I don't know. Um, Beyond me. Beyond me. Why, why do that now? Rebo's giving it away completely. Wow. Wow. What a get out of jail card that was. Blimey. Oh, we're going backwards again. And again. That's a good ball. That's a great ball. Oh, Adam Armstrong. Yeah. It's in. It's back again. <laughs> Zombie Nation returns. in this ground has just died and gone ice cold. Checking a goal for possible offside. This could be good, but that has turned the mood sour. How long does this take? Minimum of four minutes at a time at the end of the second Four minutes. Four minutes at a time. They're still checking this offside decision. Like, how long does it take? This is mental.
I've just got a feeling they're going to give it. Everybody's lined up on the centre spot. Tall Paul's waiting to come on. This is absolute joke. Absolute joke. Referee's got his hand on his ear. Come on. Come on. time for them substitutions.
Well, well, the Saints win. Russell Martin happy. The crowd are happy. Man of the match, Aaron Ramsdale. Right, so we just walked out. Um, that is 1-0. I didn't expect it to come from Adam Armstrong. Huge crowd cheers. Lots of celebration at the end there. And um, that, that VAR check at the end, that, that killed us. That killed, that, feel, that absolutely killed the vibe. You know, even, even with the end bit. I, th I think um, it, it took a bit of an edge off for sure. Wow. What do you think of the score? Uh, it was it was it was okay. It's all right. Yeah. You're happy to win. Yeah. First win this season. Yes. Who scored? Um, Adam Armstrong. And are you grateful for that? Yes. And what about our next game? Uh, I'm not too sure. Wolves, Wolves, they're We've got some whispers here. Um, We're going. We're go next week. Yeah. We're, We're going. going. I am. Yeah. Where are you going? Wolves. Wolves, excellent. Should be a good game. Okay, yeah. excellent. Well done. Anything else you want to say? Uh, not many reds. Now that Coming I heard red. you shout in a minute. Come on, you reds. Come on, you reds. Excellent. Thank you. <laughs> we have uh, Rishi Rich, Rich, Angry Rich, many names for Rich. And we were in the pub on Thursday night and we were having a chat about this game, weren't we? And we said it was going to be edgy, didn't we, mate? Definitely. Definitely. Uh, how are we feeling after uh... full time tonight? Still not convinced by it. We got we got a very lucky win. Um, we just managed to muster it. Everton really could have had a couple of goals. If it weren't for Ramsdale, man of the match by a country mile, we would have lost it. Mate, I, I also thought Fernandez was deserving of that. I thought he was fantastic. Um, how do you feel when that when that VAR that last well that from last our end minute. we could clearly see it was offside oh, could you easily oh okay easily see that it was easily offside it took so long yeah why did it take so long then because they're asses. <laughs> they're so bad aren't they, they? are it, some of they that are. refereeing was a joke again yeah. well i mean obviously you know I'm, i haven't looked back on it yet and that's always the famous last words to say um I didn't expect Adam Armstrong to get it. I thought he needed to come off, to be honest. No, I thought Stevens no, needed to come off. I think off Armstrong as well, basically for the whole game has played in the wrong position again. He was. By our stupid manager. Um, Armstrong is a better player middle of the park where he's most dangerous. Yeah. Why isolate him out there where he does nothing? Yeah, he I got all our goals well, last season by playing through the middle. Do you know he what? He should mate? be in the middle. I think in the in the first half he looked like he was more central, and then we obviously our width would have come today from five playing five at the back. You would have your wing backs uh, providing that width, and Howard, uh, sorry, uh, Manning wasn't given that width. Uh, he was just trapped. Yeah. Uh, so I think uh, Armstrong had been told or drifted out to the side. Yeah. But that just like completely left Archer alone, didn't it? it did. But. But Archer, Archer's, came... Archer is not a proven goal scorer. Armstrong is. Really, I'd probably swap their positions. Have Archer doing the business Quite down possibly. the wing and Armstrong in the middle. Yeah. I mean, I mean obviously, when, you know, when uh, Armstrong did come into the middle and he had that shot and goal, he took his chance. First time, bang in. Brilliant yeah. goal. Yeah so, yeah, so Adam Armstrong, you're watching this. Nice one. Yeah, well happy with Armstrong. Yeah, good. And well happy with Ramsdale. What do you think about the subs today? Bit dodgy again. Bit dodgy, bit weird. Yeah. Uh, the timings were quite predictable, uh, weren't they? Dib Dibbling, really, we had another chance to get a second goal where we managed to get it down the byline for once in a while, crossed it across the box, and there was no one there. Um, he, yeah. if he'd read the game a bit better and ran forward, he could have been in there for that. There was that, yeah. There yeah. was. So, uh, overall feeling today, mate? Glad we've won. Everton fans all nicely packed up on your coach, ready to go home. Bit of a long journey. Let me know in the comments, Everton fans, how do you feel? Yep, yeah, absolutely. I uh, want to hear your opinions, Everton fans, on how you thought the game went. Um, yeah, we, we, how are you about your manager, the way your season's going so far? Uh, literally, just pop up in the comments. It's a friendly place. Um, that was a tough game that you guys played it, so yeah, fair fight, I suppose. So to finish up, that was a well ground out 
win for Southampton. Uh, I didn't see that goal come in personally, so maybe that's uh, optimism that's been lacking from me. And uh, next game I'll ensure it's tip top. Thank you for watching today. If you've enjoyed it, uh, please do leave a like and a subscribe. You know, we do all the home games, we've got a season ticket. It's our first season doing this. Um, yeah, just what a relief, eh? Are we still bottom? We're going to find out in a bit, but I haven't seen the scores for the rest of the games. Excellent, so I'll see you later.